Welcome to this week's weekly AI news segment where we cover the major things that recently happened in the world of AI. So for the first news of this week, Toys R Us debuted a short promotional film of 66 seconds at the 2024 Cannes Lions Festival which was made using entirely AI. They used OpenAI Sora text to video generating tool and alongside that of course some human editing to create this ad. Although people have mixed emotions regarding it with some people being amused and some people finding it very uneasy. Regardless, it goes to show how rapidly AI is advancing. In a recent interview, Sam Altman, the CEO of OpenAI, addressed the growing anxiety surrounding the rapid development of AI technology. He acknowledged that these advancements are set to have a profound impact on society. As AI tools become increasingly sophisticated, it's understandable that people are concerned about their future roles. Altman explained that many worry about what will happen if AI can handle complex tasks like discovering all physics or starting and running successful companies. This uncertainty about where humans will fit in among such powerful technologies is a significant and valid concern that society will need to address on the bright side. This rapid advancement means that AI will soon be capable of handling an incredibly complex tasks. Now today we have an interesting tool for you guys which is called Figma AI. Now Figma AI empowers designers with intelligent tools to boost creativity and efficiency. Whether you're facing a creative block or need to speed up your workflow, Figma AI has you covered. Figma AI's tools include visual search and AI enhanced asset search that helps you find and reuse designs easily. AI-powered text tools let you translate, shorten, or rewrite text and generate realistic copy and images. With features like background removal, interactive prototyping, and automatic layer renaming, Figma AI keeps your files organized and developer-ready. For blank canvas moments, generate UI layouts and components from text prompts. Figma AI is available in beta for free throughout 2024, so give it a try and transform your design process. Kai Fu Lee, the chairman and CEO of Cinovation Ventures, has stated that the idea of AI displacing 50% of jobs by 2027 is very accurate. He asserts that with rapid advancements in AI such as OpenAI's ChatGPT, white-collar jobs will be impacted much more rapidly than blue-collar jobs, which could massively affect certain economies. Lee advises parents to encourage their children to start learning AI tools now so they don't fall behind in the evolving job market. That's why the AI podcast is right for you and your children because we teach you all about the new tools, including tools that you probably never heard of. Now here's something that might make you feel a little ticklish. Japanese scientists have figured out a way to create living robot skin with human cells. Uh, yes, you, you heard that right. You heard that right. The skin made from cultured human cells on a collagen scaffold over a 3D printed resin base mimics human expressions when attached to a robotic face, even forming wrinkles over a month. However, despite its realistic look, it lacks sensory functions and blood vessels limiting its durability. Therefore, researchers plan to improve it by adding neural mechanisms and perfusion channels. Basically, what it means is that they are making robots that replicate humanoid skin. So if you've had enough of that, Mark Zuckerberg recently stated that he does not believe in or support the idea of a single AI entity ruling over all, as if it were a god. This belief is part of why he advocates for open source. Zuckerberg emphasizes that the goal of developing diverse AI tools is to make them accessible to everyone, allowing people and companies to blend their creativity with these tools to create innovative solutions. This inclusive and collaborative approach to AI development is the future he envisions. And to be honest, I completely agree with him. I don't know, I find it a pretty big turnoff when people in the um, in the tech industry kind of talk about building this one true AI. It's like, it's almost as if they they kind of think they're creating God or something. And it's it's like, it's just, that's not that's not what we're doing. That's not, I don't think that's how this plays out. And finally, in this week's AI news, Evolutionary Scale has created a new AI model that designs and simulates proteins, enzymes, and other biological matters for scientists. Evolutionary Scale hopes that scientists can use this tool to visualize biological substances and gain deeper insights into life sciences. This includes researching enzymes that can break down plastic, developing new medicines, studying diseases, and more. This technology is expected to advance scientific understanding and potentially lead to innovative solutions across various fields of research. And that wraps up our weekly dive in the AI news where we go over the significant advancements in the world of AI. My name is Moiz. And I'm Hassan. And this is the AI Podcast. If you enjoyed the video, click like. Let us know your thoughts down in the comments. And make sure to subscribe for everything AI.